Hello, and welcome back to OneShot. Since last time, I've been doing some testing with audio and stuff like that. I've generally just improved the volume, up the volume of all my videos now, from now on. I've known for a long time that they've been kind of quiet compared to most other videos. But from what I know about audio mixing and sound editing, they actually haven't been incorrect. It's just the fact that over time, people have just been like pushing and pushing and pushing those boundaries further and further. So now the standardized volume on YouTube is as close as humanly possible to clipping and peaking without actually doing so. So I guess I'm doing that too, even though it feels horribly wrong to just see all the red all the time, but never actually going over. I don't know. Hopefully that should be a bit better than it's been before. But I'm still not entirely happy with my sound overall. It's kind of tinny and hollow. But I'll always try to make things better if I can. And this is probably not the last time I'll tweak some stuff. But anyway, in one shot. Last time we unlocked the elevator. And I actually did go and look it up. There was a Steam thread where someone was asking the question, what happens if you just wait until he counts up to the code and someone linked? There was a video that someone actually made of them doing it and apparently the code is always consistent. It's always 63,014 seconds, which translates to about 17 and a half hours of just leaving the game running. Oh joy. The question is, they said that there's no way to like miss out on it. If you just stand there, it'll just happen on its own. But what I'm wondering is, what if you don't stand there then? What if you just go somewhere else, go to a different screen and then wait 17 hours and then come back? Or even just wait 17 hours until it's just nearly there, then you go away. Or maybe you're off screen, like still on the same elevator screen, but just not in range of him? What would happen? There's so many questions, so many things I want to know, but I don't really have 17 hours to spare, so I guess I'll wonder for all eternity. I guess if someone is ever crazy enough to do this, and they, they want to let me know, then do so. If you, like, stand with him off screen, but on the same screen, what happens when he ticks over to 63014? Or, what happens if you just leave the screen entirely? Will it just initiate the cutscene as soon as you come back, even if you've gone over? I don't know. But at least there's no achievement or anything like that, or any special ending. It is just him randomly getting the code, and then the same thing happening, and him saying, I'll go on ahead, and then it's where we are now. So, there's no difference, as far as I can tell. So at least that's nice, don't need to worry about that. Finally, now let's dig into this dream. Is this like my mom? Nico's mom or something, I would imagine? Maybe her sister or something? It's her mom, of course. That's a lot of fucking pancakes. And she's like in awe. And she ate them all in one gulp. Okay. Shalag? Um, oh, I'm pressing enter, not, not C, or said. I had another dream. Mama was there. Did you see her? Yes. She made me pancakes. I think it was my birthday. Not a cake, just pancakes. Because people always get their favorite food on their birthday. A whole lot of it. Do you have a birthday too? No. Okay, yes. Oh. Then... What's your favorite food? Is it pancakes? Wait, do you like pancakes? Oh boy, um... So here's the deal. I actually don't. I mean, I don't hate pancakes. I... they're fine. But I don't love it. I'm not like, yeah, pancakes, sure. I don't know, there's a lot of stuff like that. Pancakes, I'm not too keen on. Strawberries, they're fine. Like, whatever, I don't really care. Waffles as well, not too keen on those. And chocolate ice cream, not a fan. 
I'm probably just defective or something, but yeah, it's it's kind of crazy. So I really should say no, but I feel like that's kind of... That's, that's bad for Nico. I'm almost thinking I want to say yes now so that I can do a I am a horrible person, I'm gonna fuck everything up run where I just bully Nico the entire time and then I say no. But I don't know. I'm gonna just say, sure, I like them, because it is actually true, I do like them, I just don't prefer to eat them most of the time. Me too! On my last birthday, I ate ten of them. I was so full I didn't eat anything else that day. My mama makes the best pancakes, and some of the neighbors make really good noodles. And oh, one of our neighbors makes a lot of... neighbors make a lot of bread. Hmm. Do you have any neighbors? Unfortunately, I do. Oh, do they share their food with you? Nope. That's not very nice of them. I mean, I don't share my food with them either. Our neighbors and my mama take turns making food for the whole village each day. Everyone also takes turns doing chores and watching the little kids. I don't need to be watched anymore, though. I'm old enough to help out. I miss everyone. I've been gone for a while now, haven't I? I wonder if they're worried about me. Ah, speaking of helping out, we should probably go now. Well, that was a, an extensive cutscene. We should get going now, Shalag. And if I leave and come back, is she gonna say that again, or that she isn't tired anymore? Yeah, we should get going. Alright, so there we go, another dream. They are quite interesting, and here we have the elevator. But I'm gonna wait with that. We have a mission, we have more water. Gotta pour it on mace and see what happens. I really hope something happens like right away so we can get closure for this and... I don't know if I'm missing something. We've given it dirt and water, but will that be enough? Tube of water. The label says water sample. Let's do it again. Oh. Oh no. So that's not what you do. Oh boy. Um. I guess I can't really do much at this point. Yeah, I thought light bulb would be good. And I, I can't combine anything, can I? Oh, can't do that. Nope. I don't think I really can do much right now. Huh. That's a bit of a shame. I guess I'll walk around a little bit and just see if I can figure something out, because that's... That is a, a great shame. They're like, she's implying that we have to do something. Explain again. Uh... Water? Nope. She's kind of implying that there might be something more we can do. Like, is this actually enough? She's not saying, we've probably done everything we can at this point, but maybe that's just like... Just to sow the seeds of doubt. It's not actually... We actually have done what I need to do? I don't know. I'm just gonna start by going to the plant dude. Stretching towards the sun. Let's use the tube of water. Yeah, not there. Yeah, and this is all just the same. Oh! Shit, what happens if you use this sink instead of the kitchen sink? Oh, maybe this is like better water or something. I, I doubt it. But damn, maybe I should have tried that. Oh no. Have I messed up by taking the wrong water sample? Good luck with that seed. I need more than luck, I need some advice. 
Come on, guy. Give me something, please. Ah. Uh, I I don't think I can really do anything anymore. But why would you be able to refill the water sample if you don't use it here? Why would we need to take it further? And surely we don't come back up here. We haven't been able to go back to any other area, so why would we need to go back from the surface up here? Oh man, this is kind of kind of sad. I already know I've missed stuff, but this is like I've gotten so close, I feel, but I might have to just leave it cuz I don't know what else I could possibly do. And PC guy, of course, is just off. Yeah. And we have this door that I don't know what to do with. Small screen. Don't know what that's all about. Yeah, no. And there's some kind of like code up here. Three, two, two, two. Is that like Morse code or like long, 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 short, long, long, short, long, long, short, long, long? That wouldn't make any sense. That would be like four characters and just like A S S S extended ass. I don't know. I don't really have any ideas for what I could do here. Oh boy, I guess the time has come for... for us to leave. I don't know what else I can do at this point, so I kinda just have to go... Stapler. I haven't had a use for the stapler either. But I don't know why I would need the stapler. And more tape, I don't need that. And the terminal is still nothing. And this robot is nothing. There's a lot of areas and characters here in the city that don't seem to have a purpose. Hmm. Yeah, I think I'm gonna have to throw in the towel and accept my fate. Oh shit. Oh hey, welcome back, I think he said. That sure took you a while, huh? I wonder what happens if you just go straight in. Oh shoot, you've been waiting this whole time? And holding the door open? Well, I uh, didn't want to be rude. I'm sorry, I should have told you to go on ahead. Uh, don't worry about it. So what, is that like if I sleep afterwards, or is that just, oh, elevator music, beautiful. Is that just if you leave the screen and come back, maybe? Awkward. Sure is taking a while. Mm-hmm. Oh, goodness gracious, I'm stuck in an elevator with a messiah and also literally god themselves, this is awkward. Oh, maybe we can chat to pass the time then. You heard me? I mean, sure. Alright, Shalag, should I... Holy fuck. Ask about his job? Ask about a city? Or this city? Ask about the library? Resume awkward silence. I really want to do that at some point, but not now. I wonder if you could ask his job about his job before you talk to the... the cafe owner, the... whatever. She didn't really have a name or anything, because she said, oh, ask him about, it, about his job, but you probably can anyway, so let's do it. So, what do you do at your job? You seem really busy. I, uh, I fix lights, mostly, but now I also deliver and refill high-energy phosphor to, to structures that need them. High energy? 
You know, the super concentrated glowy stuff they had to process in factories. It's what powers most of this city's stuff. Oh! We used to have a small army of delivery robots doing that. But lately a bunch of them have been breaking down, question mark? I mean, you're... you... you tell me. Are they? Was that a question or a statement? So until they fix them, I'll just have more work on my plate. I haven't slept in so long. When will the robots get fixed? I have no idea. It's all up to the scientists over at the labs. But they seem really concerned about something else lately. Oh? Never a good sign when even the smart folks are worried. Alright, Shalag, should I ask about his job again? So what do you do? Okay, alright. I don't want to spam X here though, because then I would just resume awkward silence when I get to the end. There we go. Ask about the city. This city is very big. It's smaller than it looks. Getting pretty crowded too. First, there was the refugees, there were, from the barons, and now more glen folks are moving in too. Oh? It's just safer here, you know? I mean, it's not... It's not a haven by any means. That square stuff that we just saw, we get more of that here than anywhere else, apparently. I noticed. We're lucky it only seems to affect the city's infrastructure. The landmass itself is still holding up. Which is good, since there isn't much solid land here in the first place. <sighs> Gotta just do it for science. Okay, there we go. Library! Can you tell me about the library? I'm supposed to go there. Oh yeah, that's one of my main delivery spots. Those reading lights are pretty high maintenance. But I always feel out of place surrounded by smart people. Well, I guess you're pretty smart yourself, so you'll fit in fine. You and Schlag. Oh, and that was it. Journey complete. Anyway, it was nice meeting you, uh... Nico! Right, see you around, kid. Gotta run now. Yep, he seems in a hurry. I guess we should hurry too, Shalag. People are counting on us. Let's go find that library. Oh my god, can I go back? Holy shit, I can go back up? Oh my god, we're not locked out from the city forever. It's not like a fourth area. Oh god. Oh, what now? Are- mm-hmm. Oh, no, I thought we would have a heart-to-heart. -heart. Nico and me. Alright, good! Excellent! So I actually can still do stuff. Yeah, I was kind of thinking it would be like, the city, that was it, and then you go to the surface, and now that's a new thing entirely. And... That would be awful, but no? So we still have a chance here with the whole, the whole corn seed thing. I'm just gonna try this again. Okay, nope, nothing. Didn't like trigger off of that cutscene or whatever. So now I can in good conscience leave behind the upper city and just go to the surface instead. Because I guess it's still part of the city, really. Maybe we'll find some, like, book on it in the library or something like that. I'll need to push the button to open the doors. Like, we'll go to the library and read about Mace or the Guardian or something like that. And then maybe that gives us an idea for what to do. Mm-hmm. This is weird. It's the city song, but just slow down and pitch down. A street lamp. A street lamp. A street lamp. A street lamp. Beep boop. Beep boop. Good talk. Hello, fancy guy. Ah, uh, you all right? Ah, the messiah. Perhaps this is a sign. Tell me. Do you think you can fix the world with a sun? Honestly, I don't know. I've been getting mixed messages. I know. But what do you think? 
I think... I think I should listen to Schlag. Hey, fuck you. Make your own choice. Don't just put this all on me. After all, Schlag helped me get this far. I will take your faith for an answer then. What do you mean by that? It means whatever you think it means. Very cryptic guy. Sigh. Oh, god damn it. Can we go in here? Nope. Can't go in anywhere here. New screen? No? Okay, we can go up there. In there? Down there? And hello? What are you, like mailman bot? Evening news! Evening news! Are you here to purchase a copy? No? Newspapers are for grown-ups. Grown-ups? Yeah. What does that mean? It means people who aren't kids. Kids? Uh, aren't you a kid? I am a robot. Right. Evening news, evening news. Oh fuck, shit, that was actually stuff, god damn it. Oh no, the, I missed a line. God, I hate when they do that. It's like the same starting line, so I just assume it's the same, but then it isn't. The Messiah is currently speaking to Newspot Unit 28, which is me. Hello, Messiah. Hi. Maybe I'll get, like, maybe it'll cycle around and I'll get to it again. Disturbance was detected from the ground access elevator on Main Street. However, the issue quickly resolved itself before investigations could take place. Okay, I'm just gonna stop that because this might take a while. Evening News Community Bulletin. The library released several new books by the elusive author last week. The head librarian recommends them. The assistant librarian had no comment, and he reportedly fled the scene sobbing. The receptionist had no comment either, because the receptionist is a robot. Evening news? The messiah? Wait, no, yeah, that's shit. Oh, okay, so it's like randomized. I am not certain that it is evening. But my light sensors are not detecting daylight. I will assume it is evening. Disturbance was detected, yep. The library released several new books, yep. Was that the, the one, the disturbance? Was that the first one I actually got and skipped past, maybe? So I, I guess it might be done. Oh no, God damn it! there it was! Fucking Christ. Okay, I'm just gonna... Strange sounds have been reported from the slums. Their source is unknown. These sounds have been described as faint bleeding or bleating by the area's residents. There's a demon goat somewhere. So yeah, I'm just gonna spam until I get that again. Disturbance. Maintenance is struggling to fix the major pipeline collapse in the north sector. Likelihood of an imminent water shortage in the inner city is now 84.2%. That's not good. And I assume we've gotten all of them. Maybe. Maybe that's an achievement, listening to all of the evening news. Yeah, it seems like that's kind of it. Unless there's one that's like ultra rare and you have to talk to him for a hundred times. Three more times. So that's one. Two. And nothing. Alright, so there we go. Evening news are done. And this episode is done. At least we can still go up in the elevator so we can try and find out something about maze and what we could use the water sample for. Like, why would we need another one now if not for maze? Maybe we need it if we find like some sort of scientist man and he's like, oh yeah, you need to actually give her this supplement thing, fertilizer, whatever, and it needs to be in water. I don't know. I guess we'll find out. Hopefully I haven't missed anything yet. But I mean, if I don't manage to find and complete the entire quest, then so be it. I'll start looking into things a bit more for the future, future runs and stuff. So hopefully, eventually, I can do the most things in the game, but for now, we'll just stick with what happens for the most part. 
Thanks for watching, hope you enjoyed the episode, and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye!